Cross-chain interoperability is going to be a huge part of the future of blockchain technology. We're going to look at one of the biggest players in the game, that's Router Protocol. Welcome back to the APY Guy channel, where I try to bring you the best sources of passive income through farming and staking of blue chips, to low market cap gems like the one we have today in Router Protocol. They can have huge gains in the next bull market. If any of that sounds good to you, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Drop a like on this video. I'd really appreciate it. Nothing on this channel or in this video is financial advice. I'm not a financial advisor. Please do your own research. Router Protocol is one of my favorite low market cap gems. I've done a video on this once. Uh, there is some new staking slash farming that we're going to take a look at at the end of this video. It's very interesting. They've had some updates on their website. It looks pretty cool. It says here, onboarding the next billion users to Web3 by destroying blockchain segregation. A secure, scalable, modular, composable framework for cross-chain interoperability. There are 30 plus blockchains with their own communities and dApps, but bridges get hacked and the information between them translates, transmits slowly. Lack of a secure interoperability limits the Web3 ecosystem growth because of the following. Fragmented liquidity, different chains can't different chains can't share liquidity, resulting in lower liquidity in every chain. Collaboration limits, it's hard to collaborate and share communities between networks, resulting in small segregated communities and security breaches. Existing bridges are not secure and decentralized, and they get hacked often, resulting in low trust in the ecosystem. With router protocol, different blockchains can finally understand each other. Router is a layer one chain that connects different blockchains. You can swap assets, send messages, and build iDAPs across multiple chains. They have a bunch listed. Uh, so far, Ethereum, Polygon, uh, Binance Smart Chain, Avalanche, Phantom, Aurora, Kava, Base, Arbitrum, and soon to be Moonbeam and Moon River, it looks like. If you're convinced, uh, they're showing that you can build on it. They're saying, or if you were conventional suits, you can build some boring stuff. And it says, if you're a Giga Chad, you can create something that the market truly needs. They're showing a bunch of different things that you can build on router protocol. Uh, one chain to connect them all. They uh, go, come down here and they show exactly how it works. Uh, all the ins and outs. I'm not going to go through all that today. Uh, we are ready to pay $200,000 to anyone who can hack router ma uh, version 2 mainnet. But this is never going to happen because they're showing why they are so uh, secure. There's a validation system. The network can only be compromised if the voting power of more than 67% decides to collude and engage in malicious activities. Uh, proof of stake to uh, economics. Any node having excessive downtime or engaging in any type of uh, malicious activity will be penalized by having a portion of their staked route slash. Uh, R-O-U-T-E is the route token. Uh, that's the main token of the protocol. Bridge level security. Any inbound request from an external chain goes through a precise validation process. We also have a security SWAT team that's never going to let anyone hack the system. You feel empowered as a developer when building on router, build highly customizable iDAPs based on your needs. See how router works with Voyager cross-chain asset swap. All right, let's take a look. Let's go to the Voyager app here. It's app.voyager.io. And then here's the swap option. It looks like there are one, two, three, four, five, six on the from side, and then uh, the same on the to side. And then there's hundreds of different uh, tokens that you can swap uh, to and from. 
and the gas fees are in router token. So if we go back here, it says powered by route token. Route is a transferable representation of a functional asset that will be used as the gas and governance token in the router ecosystem. Gas currency route token will be used for cross-chain and native transactions, validator incentives, block rewards will be paid out in the route token. At the center of the NPOS is route. Governance, the holders of route token will be able to vote on the future of the protocol. Let's take a look at the price action and the tokenomics. It's currently sitting at $2.19. The all-time high for the route token is $19.08. That is about a 9x to the all-time high from where it currently sits. The market cap is $25.7 million, which is definitely low cap. The circulating supply is $11.7 million, which is very low. And the total supply is a small amount, which is 20 million tokens. Okay, so does this look like a good uh, token to accumulate? I do think so. Okay, the way we're going to do that is we're going to go to exchange.dfyn.network. We're going to be on the Polygon network. And if we come down here and we search route... There's going to be two different pools that we can get into. Uh, the easiest way for uh, that I was able to get into this is to transfer uh, Matic tokens over into your MetaMask from I used KuCoin Exchange. Then once you have your Matic tokens in your Polygon Matic wallet, then you can add liquidity. Uh, if you hit trade, you can swap tokens. You can swap Matic over to route or you can uh swap uh matic over to usdc depending on which farm you want to get into the route uh usdc pool is paying out at 34.48 percent apr that is a good one and it's paying out i believe in the route token which is correct it is paying out in the route token my uh, strategy behind this is you could, or you could either do this two ways. You can farm in the route USDC. You can receive your route rewards. You can put them in the single asset farm route uh, protocol down here, route uh, single asset farm down here and earn 8.1%. Or you can take your rewards and you can put them... Um, uh, pull them with more USDC and then just kind of circulate it back into the route USDC pool. Uh, you would have to add more USDC as you go. Um, so that's going to be a preference thing depending on what you uh, want to do. Another kind of cool uh, pool in this one is the Matic USDC is 28.68% APR, which is definitely a good, uh, a good deal as well. Okay, people are going to ask if this is safe. Uh, I don't know. I, I, it's safer than most. Uh, this protocol's been around for a while. I've got into it multiple times. I have not had any problems thus far. Uh, everything in crypto is uh, risky at this point. So make sure you do your own research and uh, don't uh, risk anything that you are not willing to lose. Uh, I have been in this route uh, USDC pool and the route single asset farm for a while. Uh, and this, this particular protocol has been around for, I know, well over a year. Okay, that's route protocol, one of my faves. And this is how you can earn some passive income and to stack route tokens uh, in this bear market. Any questions, leave them in the comments. I'll be more than happy to answer them. As always, thank you for watching and have a great day.